What's going on, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? Rollo88 coming at the live of the flesh yet again. And in the Holy Spirit. I didn't really show you guys this. I got my night things over here in the clock. Anyways, I need to get new flooring. But I really don't have enough money. So, we got some stuff to talk about tonight. My friends and family, fellow believers in Jesus Christ. <laughs> I hope there's a lot of you out there. So, um, yeah, I was thinking about this game, right? And I got to thinking, you know, the homosexual lifestyle, because they try to make that, you know, this guy talks like that in this game. Oh my, I don't know if I want to do that. You know, like, he's not just lighting his loafers, he's not even wearing loafers, you know what I mean? So anyways... Um, yeah, so the homosexual lifestyle is actually a homosexual death style, because it ends in death. You either get AIDS and die, or, you know, you keep living in your sin, God judges you for it, and you end up in hell. That's basically it. So... It's a homosexual death style, not a lifestyle. Now, uh, they just did this um, thing, this thing on the Capitol or whatever, talking about abortion, right? And uh, seriously, I don't even know how you people can do this. We're just now figuring out that abortion is the reason for the end of the age, which y'all should have known way back when, but apparently. Uh, you know, grandparents' generation is just, but, um, you know, like the brain cells just are missing or something. Um, I, I mean, you know, I respect my elders, but how did abortion get legalized, you know? Anyways, um, I just think it's fascinating that you can have a family. You can have one man and one woman, one plus one. And at the end of it, it can equal three. One plus one equals three because a little baby gets born. See what I'm saying? So, with, you know, with a true family, it's one plus one equals three. That's just value right there, man. That baby, you know. And then when you get old, your baby is sitting there making money. And they can help you in your retirement when you're on your deathbed, you know. And when, you know, they're working for their retirement and their family. So we can have more babies, you know? I think it's beautiful. Anybody who's anti-life, I mean, just, you know, like, there's a way out of life if you don't like it. <laughs> you know what I mean? But, I mean, you've got to have hope if you do have life. And that hope comes from Jesus Christ. So, anyways, I just felt led to say all of this to you because... You know, there's this huge agenda to feminize men. You most like Eminem being a, a secret woman, you know, transgendered. And Jay-Z, and Beyonce, and all the rest of them. Come out of her, my people, you know. It's pagan Babylon. There's nothing new under the sun. But of course, you guys all buy things up like there is, like something new happens every year. I got news for you. There's nothing new. 2019 is going to be the same as 2000 was, you know? As much as changes is as much that stays the same. I've been around since 88, so I know all this. Anyway, um, another thing. God is a man. So, Ariana Grande... I rebuke you in the name of Jesus Christ. And, uh, yeah, you need to stop feminizing men because we're men, okay? You really can't feminize a man. And I get it, right? Now, in my own personal life, it's like, you know, it seemed like my parents would value, like, projects over me, but 
It's just tough love. It's because we had to get things done. Which y'all rich elites don't understand because you get everything done for you. Because everyone worships you. False idols. See? Anyway. So yeah. You think you got to feminize men because women are smarter. Right? Um... Well, explain that one to me, right? How are women smarter? You know, I'm not saying they're not. I know there was a, a typographer in my grades, or in my middle school. She, uh, man, she was amazing. She started her own business. She'd do your homework for like $5, you know what I'm saying? Like, she had a hustle, side hustle, 4.0, like she was something else. But the thing is, the women thing, it's like the Sophia, the AI, all that stuff, you know? So artificial intelligence, it's artificial, it's fake. So you're going to say that artificial intelligence is smarter than real human intelligence? I don't think so. So just stay manual. Don't make things automatic. All right? And like I get it, it's better to drive, you know, like a two-cylinder than it is to drive a, a manual or something, you know. If you're talking about like driving in a car, stuff like that. So, anyways. I don't care if like 90% of my audience tuned out. I probably didn't want you here in the first place. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I love y'all. But yeah, it's just funny. And I like this poop. Like, what is this? You got poop in a video game? Anyways. Just reminds me of, like, Noah, the unclean animals, the clean animals, RFID chip, all that crap. Anyways. Don't take it, by the way. It's going to be a lot of deception coming up. Um, let's see here. Sell those. So I'm supposed to go on a hangout with Merlin. Alright, so we'll do that. But yeah, I hope everyone gives it up to Jesus Christ, you know? Because that's the only way to get out of this satanic matrix and never come back, you know? Wow. Okay. And I hope you guys are stocked up, too, because... I don't know how long this shutdown is going to last. What? Want on a date? Let's go to my house. Okay. So she's going to be at my house for a date at 10 in the morning. That is about the strangest thing ever. Who goes on a date at 10 in the morning? Awkward. There's a little pinky. Go eat some more food, pinky. So yeah, I've been looking at this fountain, but I don't know where the welding rods are. Pretty sure I can get valves, but I have no clue about the welding rods. So we're going to go on that date on Thursday. Whoa. It's like we're dating. Watch her just be right next to my bed. <laughs> so 
So who's excited for Resident Evil 2 anyways? I'm really hoping it's more like Resident Evil 2 and less like Resident Evil 7. Because Resident Evil 7 was wet garbage. <laughs> it really was. Was not a fan of Resident Evil 7. The one part with the clown and the balloon and the stove was kind of cool though. But I digress. Yeah, get some more trees, y'all. Let's go out to the old ghost islands. You know what? Maybe that's what I can do for you for this stream. I'll um, head into that haunted cave and shoot the old scary gun at them. Oh, wait. Oh, time. Maybe go on that date. So much stuff happening. <laughs> Hopefully we can get a little bit of wood before she shows up for the day. It says hang out though. You know, hanging out and dating is two different things. It's like all you fools out or all you call nobody a fool, sorry. All you folks out there say Netflix and chill or whatever. It's like okay. It's not too appropriate. So whatever happened to watching our language, you know? Because when kids hear that, it's like, what does that mean? You know, the kids want to know what you're talking about. It's like, you know? It's like, at least be a little bit um, tactful and subtle about it, you know? Anyway, once again, I digress because that's all I can do. There she is. What's up, old lady? Dating starts. Um. Oh, okay. Guess we're walking, huh? Come on. Come on, old woman. Not the hottest date I've ever been on, but it'll work. Come on. What should we do? Wanna go get some food? Uh, I don't know what to do. Rainbow lemonade? There, I'll give her a rainbow lemonade. Cheers. Okay, did she not like that? News camera. Are we supposed to go to the Porsche Times maybe? Come on, keep up old woman. Okay, I'm going to give her a little something to drink. Working on this newspaper. She's getting thirsty. I will actually stop. <laughs> okay. Where'd she go? Mm. Not sure what she wants. Are we supposed to walk a certain distance or something? OK. 
Okay. You talk about. Okay. Look, lady, I don't know what you want. Oh, okay, she likes that, huh? Darn right. Got muscle, baby. Give it a gander, Merlin. Knocking out a big one. You know what I'm saying? All right. And there it is. I got mouths to feed, pal. Actually, I don't. Which is why I'm really cut out for this Jesus work. Great commission. understand this. I think I'm going to end the date. See. What? How do I get a minus 11? Are you kidding me? Wow. Okay then. Oh look, I got big gloves. It's funny when I run. Joke's over. Everyone's a comedian, right? got to be more to life and there is I promise y'all you'll see just give me some time you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying okay cool you do know what I'm saying boom out of energy that was unexpected <laughs> love this hat though Reminds me of, uh, I believe there's some Bible verse about when the abomination of desolation comes, which Daniel spoke about. Um, we will get the wings of an eagle, whether that means like figuratively, like be able to escape, or whether that means um, literally we could get the wings of an eagle. And that would just be cool. So yeah. I want wings of an eagle fly around. That'd be cool, man. It's funny, too. I was watching that preview for that new Shazam show or whatever, even though it looks like garbage. And the little crippled kid's like, um, what did he say? If you had one power, it'd be the power to fly or whatever. I'm like, yeah, maybe so. Ooh, this is new. Stainless aluminum. Okay.
Huh. Oh, where do I get stainless aluminum? I need those aluminum plates so I can upgrade my house. Some aluminum. No. Maybe. No. Okay. Well, I don't know what to tell you guys. Oh yeah, we didn't get a whole bunch of wood, did we? You guys know like back in the day we used to just stay up and have fun we should do that again even though I don't know <laughs> I notice people are getting a lot more energy back in their lives that's good taking back all the years the locusts ate when the elites tried to take from us you know trying to kill everyone of course it's no different now it's still Satan he's still just trying to get you to take an RFID chip and be miserable that's the thing with the conditioning and everything like these words are gonna be falling on deaf ears and everything else because you guys would rather live in this world than think about eternal heavenly things, you know? Not all of you, I know that. I've got my people that I do love very much. And I will not name names, so there you go. <laughs> Bye! To the haunted cave for you guys. That's a funny sound. Oops. Oh no, I got hit. My bad. It's a little bit out of season. Does that frighten anybody else that all this demonic stuff is like year round now? It really it doesn't sit well with me. Okay, let me go. Thank you. Okay. That way. Oops. Oh, scary. I don't have a spirit of fear. Ghost badge. Give it up. Oops. Hey, I'm 
do it. All right. Oh, there you go. So we already talked about that Mandela thing, Mandela Bond thing. One of the authors of James Bond was a Mandela guy. And actually James Bond is a mockery of Jesus Christ. Especially that one that they did where he gets shot off the, the moving train or whatever. That was really blasphemous. So. All I know is Harry Potter is a warlock and an enemy of God. So. And that's true. And actually he's not a warlock. He's a, like a male witch. Which to me just seems embarrassing. Why are you going to take on a female title even for like something occult like that? You know what I'm saying? But of course that's what J.K. Rowling wants. With her, you know, everything's homosexual and deviant. It's for the kids, you know? It's for the kids. And y'all buy into it like, you know? Like, you have to. You don't have to buy into it. Just because it's popular doesn't mean you have to spend money on it, you know? Well, how else are we supposed to enjoy it? You're not supposed to enjoy it. That's why it's popular. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I'm guilty of it. I used to love, like, Lord of the Rings and everything. I jumped way deep into that stuff, man. Shoot, that's, I mean, I jumped so deep in there, it's like, you know, God forgive me, because I was like an idol in my life, you know? And you're like, oh, how could it be bad, you know? It's bad. It's all bad. It's just like how you know, I'm pretty sure like God hates war too, you know, and yet we always have to have be in a war, you know, why can't we just be at peace? Too much to ask, right? Not enough money to be made in peace. See, that's a fallacy right there. We're smart enough to live in peace and without the RFID chip and without the Antichrist but all these things shall come to pass so I mean if I wasn't a prophet in my time what, what else would I be you know? oh I missed the martial arts tournament oh no oh man I wanted to get that uh there's a really cool shirt you get for doing the martial arts thing. I wanted to get it. It's like a Bruce Lee sort of thing. And of course, Bruce Lee, Enter the Dragon. We can talk about, you know, the occult meanings behind that, but I mean, Bruce Lee was very spiritual too. He knew about, like, water and stuff. It would be like water. And, but you see how those teachings replace um, what Jesus said? You see? Jesus is first above all things. So. Huge Bruce Lee fan too, though. I mean. Considering, you know. And then, was it Jason Lee or something? The Crow? That was a good film. If he did die on the set, you know. Some of that stuff, like, you honor the memory, but you still have to question everything, so. There's such a strange history with Heli Weird, you know? I mean, you wouldn't want to mess with it in a hundred years. And yet, it's the stuff we can't help but absorb ourselves into year after year. 
I can help it though. Now that I'm old enough to know better. Okay, I'm betting my money on the dude. And the dude. The Big Lebowski would be proud. Who'll be the champ this time? I don't know. Let's see. Okay, good. I picked the right one. Beat her up. <laughs> You know it's funny too. I, this actually brings up a good point. Like there can be domestic abuse against women, and there can also be domestic abuse against men. So I don't know. Of course, the one that only gets publicized is when it's against women, because it's all to uh, tear down men. You know. Yes, there's still real people in this world. <laughs> I'm one of them. The Predition. Okay. Where's Sanwa? Sanwa! Get up there, boy. You're going to fight. Get in there. I'm gonna push you in there. Go, go, go. So I've been waiting on this um, installation zero one game to come out. It's a new Halo game. It's free online in browser. And they are just taking their sweet time making it. But it, you know, it looks pretty good. They got the nice graphics and all that, but whatever. If you're wondering why we can't have nice things, look to the mind control of the U.S. government. Come on, San Juan. You got this. Got him. Come on, San Juan. There you go. Good job. Out of your sensei. <laughs> You're just jealous because I've been chatting online with hot babes all day. Uh oh. Oh, she's slapping him. Oh, oh. Oh, come on, Sam. Yep. Go for it. Go for it. <laughs> Got a bet. San or Arlo's 33, San Juan's 25. Arlo's obviously gonna win. Come on, boys, get back in there. <laughs> Have a chicken. Chicken is code for, you know, kids. Sad, 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 sad. They traffic in kids. Anyways. The truth is out there. Oh, look, we found it. Guess I don't have to watch X-Files anymore. Let's go, boys. Come on, Arlo. You got this. Ooh, uppercut. Nice. Smack him up. I 
and that's the tournament. See ya! Hmm. Actually, I'm gonna find out how to get this welding rod. Oh wait. Finish. Good job, boys. Get out of there. Oh man, three rounds, really? Cool, cool. Yay, Armado. You did it. Good job. I bet you I can beat you. <laughs> see I've got 14 of those Kung Fu badges okay Be a good look if I can afford it. Okay, he needs to stop stopping. That is a really bad bug. Some of the stuff it's like you report it and they don't fix it. My favorite. Huh. Steaming piles. <laughs> See if they have any food in here. Oh wow, they ate all the hot man. I'll just keep throwing plant fibers at them. Alright. So, I'm 
Okay, six. Eh. And six. We'll just look at it. When in 40, we have 36. Well, that's not good. An old world dish that contains seafood. Yum yum. My attack went up. Cool. Oh boy. Steel plates. Oh, we got steel plates. Okay. Oh, aluminum. Okay. charcoal then. Wow. Still need wood boys and girls. Huh. Bloodstones from Quarry. We need two of these so we're good. Just need a bunch of bloodstone. Saw a new quest appear. No. So this over here is the quarry, and the other thing is the mines. In case you didn't know that, but I'm sure that y'all seem to know it. that song I believe most people are good I never liked that song it's like nobody's good except the Heavenly Father you know now Florida Georgia line you got that uh God your mama and me unconditionally that's a good song even though nothing's good except my Heavenly Father see that's the only double standard we should have Nothing's good except God. Not the God of this uh, earth either. Because that's a huge deception. People go to these apostate buildings and worship Satan. And soon the Antichrist. So, just throwing that out there. Seeing an official bite. <laughs> Yes, I know. It's late. I get it. Mm -hmm. Here we are again, back at it. Um, I can make those little things for my thing, Jig. Nope, still need two more. Okay. So 
say if you if you're living in sin, you're living a you're not living a lifestyle. You're actually living a death style. So go and transgress the law no more. Go and sin no more. And I get it. Nobody's perfect, okay? Before you jump down my throat. What's up, Emily? Are you kidding me? Did she just order three more? How about some apples? There you go. I need those bloodstones. Oh boy. Oh, it's not happening. There we go. Maybe. So I hope that everyone has having a blessed day. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. By the way, once CERN goes crazy, you're going to want Jesus. So. But nobody knows the day or the hour. So that's kind of a relief. Okay, boys and girls, let's pray we get some bloodstones in here. So you heard my opinion on homosexuality and marriage and masculinity, which is all good. God smiles on certain things, you know, we are his creation. Oh boy, I can't get out. My advice is never give up unless it's the more heavenly thing to do in terms of not taking RFID chip and you know, going to heaven. There's worse things than death, like hell. Just throwing that out there as well. I know, right? Super positive video. Got birds chirping, talking about hell. <laughs> So that place had zero bloodstones. Oops. We're go back to sleep actually. Zero energy left.
Mm -hmm. Alrighty then. Well, thank you. So we need that industrial furnace, which means we need more bloodstones. some up here. Cross my fingers. <laughs> and don't take the RFID chip and cross your fingers. That's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. You take it, you gotta chop your hand off. And that's no laughing matter. So and I can help you with that too, but man, I really don't want to. But I will. I will. Absolutely. In a heartbeat. There are worse things than dying. You know what? This is getting grim. Let's scan for something. And hopefully we can have a little fun in that way. Okay, there we go. Yay! Ooh, power stone. I needed that. So if you guys are not subscribed to, I think it's Finnis Temporis or something on YouTube, one of my absolute favorite channels. They do that Back to the Future decode and they do, um, they just did a Requiem for a Dream decode, which I absolutely despise that movie because it's just shows like the depravity of the human condition. If you haven't seen it, I recommend that you do not ever see it. I think my ex had me watch it or something. I don't know. Not a good movie for anyone to see. It's like one of those movies that just devalues the human life, you know? It's not good. Our lives are priceless, by the way, and eternal. So just always remember that. And I understand that there's different religions and stuff. But have you ever, any of you ever asked why, you know? It used to be one world religion, right? Tower of Babylon. Now they're trying to do that again. You see, so it was actually a good thing that the religions were split apart. Because the worst thing you could do is bring all the religions together. And actually, religion is death, ultimately. Even if you were to stay in one certain religion, you would be pretty much dead anyways. That's why we just need Jesus Christ. It's funny, I've been getting a lot of hate lately. Like, oh, you're not doing the right thing. You're not a spiritual guy. I'm like, huh? How do you figure, you know?
is because I actually am above and beyond. <laughs> Look at that. I mean, I boast in the Lord Jesus, you know, if you're going to boast. The thing is, everybody likes to boast about their new Lamborghini, their new house, their new, you know, tennis shoes. Give me a break, man. Okay? cares about any of that stuff. I mean, you have to have some of it to live. You don't need it in excess, and you don't need the finest, you know, thing ever. There's nothing wrong with being humble, you know, and just barely getting by your whole life, you know. Some more power stones. Oh, I'll go up to the island. I don't have some. And then we gotta sleep again so I can get those blood stones. I need the more skull gems. That was the old thing in uh, Jack and Daxter 2 or something. I need the more soul gems. That dude was scary. So let's see here. Um, a whole lot of nothing. Come on, I need my power stones. Where they at? It might be up top, actually. Let's get this coriander. Blood stones. That's a big one. Yeah, there we go. So I noticed something the other day. I was playing Fortnite or something. And I was like the character was moving on his own, shooting on his own. I'm like, what is going on? I swear it was like AI was taking over. But I might have just been imagining it, but I doubt it. Like, I wasn't even playing it, though. You know what I'm saying? Very freaky thing. Nah, where's my bloodstones? So I was thinking about this today. I go to Afghanistan, Iraq, I come back. Countries, you know, doesn't have a whole bunch of money. But, yeah, I don't know. I'm on disability, trying to get over my depression and everything. And yeah, fun times. We need more um, home on the range solutions, you know, how the old people used to do it. That's my spit take on it. I'm 
My two cents. Oh, snakeberry. Get thee behind me, Satan. Huh. Oh. Ah, oh, bees. Pesky bees. Oh, yeah, they're supposed to do a new season of uh, Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared, right? That'll be funny. When you sit down to a picnic, pesky bees. That's a good show. I don't know if you guys saw Mr. Meaty or whatever. That was kind of freaky. Didn't really like it. Not a huge fan of the Mr. Meaty show. Anyways, don't take the RFID chip. Well, I don't know. We'll just make this thing and we'll see. Core. More bloodstones. Oh, joy. Oh, the stones are back. Good, good, good. That is good. All the time. Ooh, two for one. Two birds with one stone. Beating a dead horse. <laughs> Now it's time that we took a stand against all these evil people. Anyways, you know, they can't keep running this ship like this. It's going to sink like the Titanic, and they're not going to take us down with it. We're getting them the life rafts, and they're going to freeze to death. So, there you go. Because they're wicked, you know? Saying no rest for the wicked, right? Huh? All right. Come on, industrial furnace. Oh, these little furnaces are so terrible. Don't hardly produce nothing. Make one. Maybe not. No, oh, boy. I don't get it.
Well, I guess we're gonna figure out how to make a industrial. Well, hopefully we have data disk for Petra. We do. So yeah, I hope everybody's still having a blessed night. Jesus Christ saves, repents. I need to get um these data disks to Petra. Petra, what's up, girl? My girl. Hey, talk to me. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. You're going to discover something, yeah? Cool. I want something. Oh. You want a gift? Mom. Sweet girl. Give her a scarf. Yeah. She liked that. She knows she liked that. Come on. That's her favorite scarf now. But really though, this is the relationship that matters right here. You know what I'm saying? I'll give you some antidote your kitty. Oh no! I messed it up. Get back kitty. Markets up, yeah. I love it when the markets up. We got a ton of honey, man. Boys and girls. So there's a finance guy came by my house today. I'm like, what you know about finances, dude? <laughs> I'm like this is. Like nothing we ever seen, man. This is a recession rolled into a depression, rolled into a big old taco bravo. You know what I'm saying? It's pretty bad. But it's gonna be fun, I think. And it's not because I want things to fall apart at all. It's because I want things to get better. And they will. And they will. It's not just wishful thinking, you know. We can actually make a change in this world. So. Um. What's that stupid old Sia song? You've changed for the better. <laughs> I mean, whatever. I'll sell those. No, I don't know. I'm probably gonna need like all this stuff. So whatever. The smarter you play, the faster you play. So that's good. Yeah, I wish they would release Resident Evil 2 a day early. I really do. That would just make my day. Make my millennium. <laughs> Oh, Beetlejuice. Make my millennial. Anyways, I digress and I will stop. Oh, I could just sold those chickens. Um, let me see here. Okay, we're gonna make that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She says she'd have that industrial furnace for tomorrow, so I'll just go to sleep and get that furnace ready for us. Good, 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 good. That is good. 
Heavenly Father, God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Oh, there we go. Huh? Two days? You already had a day. Oh, well. That's cool. Excuse me. That's good, that's good. And now we're gonna make it. We do it, Resident Evil 2. <laughs> oh, I'm excited. Yay! Marvel Steel Plate and Industrial Cores. We got this. Marvel Steel Plate Industrial Core. Marble steel plate industrial cores. Gotcha. So you know that old saying about like if you've seen an angel you might not even know it? That's just fascinating. But the person would have to be a human being to be an angel. But then, you know what I'm saying? It's crazy, man. So certain humans are actually angels in this case? That's what I'm saying. That's why if you have enough spiritual discernment, you might actually be able to, to tell the difference, you know? Angels are really cool. And uh, demons, not so much, you know? We wrestle against uh, principalities, not flesh and blood. So remember that. Same old same. Eh, what do we get? 23? That's actually really good. Come on, we fuel. Okay. Um, I was going to put this here, as you guys probably could tell. Alright, we're going to do. Uh, welding rods, that's right. Oh no. Manganese. Alright. And we need valves as well. Now I'm not sure about the valves. We can maybe construct them here. Probably. Bow, 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 anywhere. Um, not so sure about that. Where would the valve be? Bow, 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 bow. Ooh. 
You know I like to make these and sell them, so let's do that. Mm -hmm. No clue where the valve is. Arm stretcher? Oh, that's right. That's the old uh, pointy thing. It's fun. Um, Oh, I need a valve. Don't we all? Um, do the valves come from the... Hmm. They must come from the... Man, I don't know. Possibly from the other place? I might need to go to the civil core and find out. Okay. Oh, whatever. The main objective is to clear up that fountain. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that reminds me. Um, in the book of Revelations, it talks about the water um, turning into wormwood. In the last days so you should stock up on water bottles and other stuff because <clears throat> you probably don't need it huh. Can you not make that aluminum stuff? No. That's a nice smelter, man. I love it. Obviously, I'm not like Jesus first, but that's a nice smelter. Just see Till he comes back, till he comes back. Da, 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 da. I don't have any fuel. Okay. Anyways, okay. Oh, power stones, that's right. If I go out to the haunted cave, I don't want to go Pardon moi? I was hoping I could afford that Kung Fu shirt, but I guess not. That's okay. We'll wait until the next tournament in a month. I'm kind of wondering like how Jesus is going to handle like families when he comes back. I mean I'm sure there's like a loving family that's together he's just going to be like this is awesome. But if they're like split up and weirded out like mine then it might be a little difficult. Anyways, you know, I love my family, I'm just saying. I don't have kids, I have mom and her parents, but, you know, you get it. 
Anyways, uh, let's see here. Um, what am I gonna do? Well, praise Jesus. How about that? Um, now oh, I can level up. Nice. Oh, what? Okay. That's, uh, apparently my, uh, skills got redistributed. That's not cool. we'll just distribute them. There you go. Hmm. Level 43. Okay. Apparently we needed to do that. Um, let me see here. Beginners classic. No sell the beginners. Mm. Don't think we need glass. At the moment. guys need to be aware too because there might be another false flag attack which would be like an EMP attack probably shut off the power and everything but I don't know when that will happen because I'm not a Freemason <laughs> oh here we go I think the valves might actually be in the, the dungeon. If I had to guess. Still don't understand what I have to do with Merlin. Apparently the date was a failure, so that's cool. It's typical. <laughs> men are pigs. No, men are men. Come on now. Let's not call names. You know what's funny is women are can actually be way more hurtful, but that's okay. 
We're not calling names, like I said. Okay, what did I need? Valves. I guess we'll try the highest thing and see. Love that sound. I don't have enough energy to do this. I really don't have enough energy for this. Floor six. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm done. Maybe if I fail, they'll give me more energy. Hopefully so, because that's what we need to do. I'm just throwing this out there. This game is better than Dark Souls. <laughs> it really isn't, but Dark Souls. Three was so easy. I can't even explain it. I gotta stop with the video games, anyways. And of course, ye hypocrites, right? And. Closer to guys though than right now. Oh what? No. What did it break or something? I'm not trying to exit. Oh come on man. Well, that's typical, isn't it? Broken games. I was watching a video of this game when I was in beta, and they like fumble around with the. Um, oh, that's cool. Blade of Malice. They fumble around with the chest to get it open. It's like this huge animation where they sit there and try to like unlock it with their hands. Really funny. did an animation in high school where this monster eats a superhero and poops him out and then the superhero points his finger out and he's like I'm number one. <laughs> oh well, that was so long ago. Life goes by so fast people. Come out of her my people. Come out of that poor Babylon. Oh dear, jump dancers are terrible. Get wrecked. Has anybody seen a valve yet? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. One more. Teeth, venom. Venom. This world ain't gonna know what hit him. Uh oh. Time, man. You keep so many secrets. Secrets don't make friends. cattle and really we're children of Jesus Christ. We belong to him, not them. Oh, come on. 
All I need is a valve. All I need is give Newell to release Half Life 3. No, I'm kidding. No one cares, Gabe. Half Life's not even that great. Actually, it was way back when, but if you're as old as me, then <laughs> you don't care anymore either. Come on, Gabe. What are you doing, Gabe? <laughs> I do think it's funny that we managed to confirm the Illuminati before we confirmed Half-Life 3. <laughs> okay, then that's... Right, boom goes the dynamite. No more stamina. There, that's all we needed. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right. I can't do nothing. Save me. Save me, Jesus. Oh wow. There we go. How you solve problems, kids. Yep. Who? What time is it? Oh, here we go. Big man. Okay, he can touch this. Her don't know me. Oh, there you go. Hey, there's my two valves. Didn't even have to do the rest of the dungeon. No, I'm kidding. How you get to the boss, right? <laughs> you gotta do the dungeon. Twanch, 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 and then he got twanch, twanch, twanch. Credit to Dash Games. Oh, I'm good. Just kidding. Heavenly Father is good. I'm nothing. Nothing. I'm nothing. I'm nothing. Okay. So now we fix the um, town fountain. That'll be fun. Oh yeah, we need new flooring, but so many things. <laughs> so much to do, so little time. Actually, we got plenty of time. Couple of few months as the crow flies. Oh, um, okay. This is kind of strange and awkward. Can I open your door, please? 
Nothing like waiting around. It's my favorite thing in the world. That. There you go. Okay, so we gotta check this real quick. See what we need to upgrade the house. This is a homestead. Iron wooden plank. Aluminum plates. That's gonna be a trick. We already have, pretty much have that. Glass and fifty thousand. All right. We just need those aluminum plates, really. This is way too hard. I don't know about that construction crane. How am I supposed to do that? Stable iron bars. Okay, we'll make some iron bars. Then we can have horses. We need a hundred thousand to expand the land too. But I don't really know if that's going to happen. We need like good market days. Dr. Zoo. Oh, there we go. Fix the pipe, fix the water. Got it, got it, got it. So I don't really know if you guys understood what I was saying by like Noah's Ark. So I'm going to re-explain it. Um, when Noah was taking animals onto the ark, he took the animals, um, seven dirty animals and two clean animals. So it was a total of nine animals, right? So the singularity with the artificial intelligence, it comes from the number nine, which divides up and down to make the vacuum more singularity. Now when you look at that, it's seven... Seven of nine, right? That was on Star Trek. Well, it was seven dirty animals and two clean animals. Now, the clean animals keep the whole computer system functioning. And the dirty animals, that's kind of like the satanic dirty side. But, you know, so that's just my thoughts on the whole artificial intelligence thing. Like, seven of nine, and it's going to be like dirty artificial intelligence that's just going to corrupt the human condition even more and just turn us into just basically demons and see there will be like two ninths of goodness in a person two ninths of cleanness but see cleanness isn't goodness you see what I'm saying um, Heavenly Father is the only good thing so yeah you're gonna be a dirty Robotic humanoid demon transhumanist garbage. And Satan's gonna have control of you. So don't do it. Here to fix the pipe? Yes. What are you doing here? I'm investigating. Wow, this kid is such a homo. Such a faggot. <laughs> Okay, let's fix it. Yep. That wasn't too dangerous. Uh -huh. Well, it smells soul caliber, that's for sure. <laughs> Let me get them back up. Maybe get. <laughs> I'm done. Let's do it. Baccarat. <laughs> That's funny.
so yeah. I hope you all understood what I was saying with the Noah's Ark and the clean and the unclean animals. You don't want that in your system. You'll just be dirty, you know. And that's not good. It's not okay. And you're probably thinking, like, I'll do anything to survive. Mm. Like that's, you know, the wrong answer, basically. Wow, that hurt. thing is you'll survive in this life but you won't survive in the next one that's not good not good at all um i have no idea what this is oh here we go hopefully Go down there. Uh, okay, there's just a random ghost flying right there. Okay. Find the exit. Okay. Oh, I see. You all just witness history. <laughs> actually do need the um, power cores here, so we're going to stick around. You. Well, hopefully there's at least one. Oh, Sapphire. Goonies never say die.
mau ya. It's burnt back around. No, I will stop. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Burnt back around. Okay. Oh, guess some dancers. Walk. is a blade fish. Uh. Oh, Danny, I love cheesecake. <laughs> you guys will check out some of my other YouTube videos. I have quite a few out there. I don't know if they'll be helpful to you, but it's helpful to me to have a you know a recording of my thoughts and my you know how things are going in the world and stuff like that. I want to be aware of spiritually, you know. That's the main purpose of my channel, so, and purpose of my life, actually, I don't need a YouTube channel to do all that, you know, I'm a twon 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 you rat king. <laughs> the toothless wonder speaks. I 
that's what my uncle says when he farts, the toothless wonder speaks. <laughs> That's what gets you brownie points, beating up on some fat, innocent rat. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, dear, dear, dear. That's not good. Ooh. medicine time yet <laughs> you know you're old when you look forward to medicine time but still I'd rather take my meds and never take the RFID man because I'll be like oh it, it makes you healthy no, it doesn't. That 5G is going to be killing people left and right. Radiation and oh, concentrated poisoning. It's going to be bad. Oh, whoops. Did I let their secret out? Oh, darn. The thing is, if you want this world, if you want to stay a part of it, you're wrong. Because <laughs> heaven is not for people who want to stay in this world. And, you know, focus on Jesus. He's the way out. I do get confused though, because I've never died before, so I don't know what the other side is like. So it raises a lot of fascinating questions about like the ether and you know judgment and just so many things. Actually, the ether, I think that's uh, like a cabal thing, where they combine all the stuff like fire and water, and just ruin creation and pervert everything. Terrible. things to truly get better we just have to stay absolutely humble through all things and be there for anyone who needs it you know I don't know not just anyone you know they have to be worthy and follow 
three days. I have people going at me like, um, man, it's just the craziest thing. Like, Jesus wasn't the Savior. I'm like, are you kidding me? Is your faith that weak? You know, blessed are those who have not seen and yet believed, you know? It's like, that's me, man. And I know that's a lot of others too. So that's good. It's comforting. And that's the thing I don't understand, right? They'll sit there and try to censor Christians and stuff, like Jesus followers. And yet they say, you yeah, know, well, if it makes you feel comfortable, I, I don't mind it. And it's like, then why are you bullying us, you know? Oh, it's because we disagree with certain lifestyles. You know, death styles, as I said earlier. <laughs> All right. Um, markets has not changed at all. Oh well. You can't expect enough market day all the time. Just not reasonable. We beat the Rat King! Yay! That means the water's gonna be clear. Yay! Rejoice! Rejoice, Emmanuel! Welcome to the Israel! Get rid of these RFID chips. <laughs> Alright. Learn these swords real quick. Oh. Well, whatever, then we'll sell it. Yep. God bless the world that He created. We gotta think bigger, people. Outsmart this life and make it into eternity. You know? That's what I'm talking about. Um, poopy. More welding rods. Oh, yeah. Did we fix the, um, Actually, what was the thing I needed? Iron bars, right? For the stable? Pretty sure. Okay. Um, steel cable. <clears throat> yeah, that could do pretty good. So yeah, be praying for California too because they're going through a tough time and um, I know there's a lot of really um, devoted Jesus followers out there and, uh, you know, Christians. And um, all their houses got burned down and um, they're going to like force them into these apostate buildings to worship the Antichrist. And so... We all need to pray for California and anywhere else. 
So yeah. Definitely. <laughs> You know, it's funny, like, uh, the future is bright, but it's dark first. So just take that as you will. It has to get dark before it gets bright, so. Jesus isn't the light, you know, he's the, you know. He's the hope. In the darkness. And yes, there might you might need to go into the darkness uh, when you die, uh, because light is all colors, and it's really just a reflection when you think about it. So yeah. I would say go into the darkness, don't go into the light. Because black is all colors. And white is just a reflection off of black to create light, you see? So yeah. Fascinating. I know. So anyways. Um, we should have sold those chickens. Actually, we need this animal skeleton for the um, enhanced iron sword, which we have needed for some time now. Oh, the cows grew up. You notice that? Blade of Malice. Wow. Huh. Venom. Enhanced bronze sword. Whatever. I don't care about this. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll report to Gail. Now let me get some sleep first. I'm gonna sell these gay couches, man. Bye bye, gay couches. <laughs> Oh yeah, we were going to try to buy some new uh, flooring, huh guys and girls? We got 10 minutes. Catalog time. Okay, um, not liking that. Options, man. Yard floor. Okay. Okay. Floor, sword, and shield. Huh.
ocean floor. I think this will match with our house a lot, so I will give that a try. See what happens. So these gay couches. <laughs> oh, there's the fountain. It's fixed. Yay, no more poison. Happy couches, right? <laughs> okay. Um, poison water. Yeah. Save those for animal food. to just sell it. Um, wow, those are pricey. Oh, okay, he's broke. <laughs> Buy from me. Wow, that's a deal. 6,000. So if you guys have those data disks, be sure to sell those because you will get a lot of money for those. I mean, that's obvious, but I didn't know until now, so that's pretty useful. Great currency to have if you don't need them for research, of course. Um. Anyways, Jesus saves, repent. Oh yeah, here we go. What do you think? Yep. I like it. It's kind of nice. Not bad, not bad. Oh, and we can do uh, wallpaper too. Because we actually have money from those data disks. Cool. Praise Jesus. Um, ocean, I think. Well, we can match it. So, yep, we're doing ocean. Yeah. 
go, folks. And that's the house, yes. Yeah. Look how roomy it looks with the ocean view, man. Beautiful. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Alright. Good stuff. Anyways, this has been Roll Away Gate. I guess we'll end the stream right here. Have a good night. Bye. Repent.